heartbroken Sinead O'Connor has tweeted a moving tribute after the tragic news that her 17-year-old son Shane has died. The 55-year-old tweeted a beautiful message announcing the teenager's tragic passing, saying, My baby. I love you so much. Please be at peace. 2. 17-year-old Shane O'Connor was found dead on Friday, January 7. Who was Shane O'Connor? Shane is the son of Sinead, an Irish singer-songwriter, and Donna Lunny, an Irish folk musician and producer. The pair split shortly after Shane was born. Shane was also one of Sinead's four children, Jake Reynolds, Roisin Waters, and Yeshua Francis Neil Bonadio. He was last seen in Tala, South Dublin, on Friday night, as police were alerted to his disappearance. Police had previously launched an appeal for assistance finding Shane with Sinead tweeting, Shane, your life is precious. God didn't chisel that beautiful smile on your beautiful face for nothing. My world would collapse without you. You are my heart. Please don't stop it from beating. Please don't harm yourself. Go to the Guardi and let's get you to hospital. This is a message for my son, Shane. Shane, it's not funny anymore all this going missing. You are scaring the crap out of me. Could you please do the right thing and present yourself at a Guardi station? If you are with Shane please call the Guardi for his safety. How did he die? Sinead and her family were reportedly concerned about Shane's mental health, as he has been admitted to Tala Hospital on suicide watch. The local police were alerted after he went missing from the hospital. Sinead took to social media to threaten the hospital with a lawsuit if anything happens to my son. She wrote, like, how has a 17-year-old traumatized young person who was on suicide watch in Tala Hospital's Lynn Ward been able to go missing? Hospital of course so far refusing to take any responsibility. Anything happens to my son on their watch? Lawsuits. I want to know why Lynn Ward at Tail Light Hospital who were supposed to have HCA supervise my child 24-7 have managed to let him out of their grasp this morning when seven days ago he made two severe suicide attempts. Unfortunately, his body was found on Friday, leaving his family devastated by the news. Police today confirmed the news with a spokesman saying, following the recovery of a body in the Bray area of Wicklow on Friday 7th of January 2022, a missing person appeal in respect of Shane O'Connor, 17 years, has been stood down. What has Sinead said? After the news of Shane's tragic death, Sinead tweeted, My beautiful son, Naveen Nesta Ali Shane O'Connor, the very light of my life, decided to end his earthly struggle today and is now with God. May he rest in peace and may no one follow his example. My baby. I love you so much. Please be at peace. She also later tweeted a Bob Marley song which she dedicated to Shane. This is for my Shaney, the light of my life, the lap of my soul, my blue-eye baby. You will always be my light. We will always be together. No boundary can separate us. 
too. A heartbroken Sinead O'Connor has posted a moving tribute to her son on Twitter credit, then.